Now to a bizarre story involving the crash of a trailer full of monkeys headed to a lab and a woman now experiencing health problems after coming in close contact with the primates. The woman says she has been put on preventative medicine for the next two weeks, but there are some questions tonight into what these monkeys were being used for and what they could have been infected with. Look down in more and it pops up. Michelle Fallon never thought something like this would happen. I thought, well, zoo monkeys. You know, I didn't know these were animal test monkeys. After witnessing a crash on a Pennsylvania highway and stopping to help, she learned the truck was carrying 100 monkeys from East Africa, headed for a Missouri test lab. I thought they were like, okay, like they had their shots, they're good, yeah. they've been checked. I didn't know they could have diseases or whatever. After checking to make sure the driver was okay, she went up to the trailer full of crates, thinking there were cats inside. They had this like green cloth over, so I peel it back and I go to stick my finger in there to try to pet it, and it pops its head up, and I'm like, oh, it's a monkey. Three of the monkeys escaped in the crash, and one was recovered. Two others were put down. But the hours long escape forced health officials to issue an alert warning the community not to come into close contact with the primates because the species commonly spreads herpes virus B. I'm like, well, I was there and I touched everything. That alert leaving Michelle on edge and unsure of what to do. Her close contact later leading to pink eye and flu like symptoms. I walked through their poop, I touched their crates, I tried to pet them. So now I don't know what's going on. As a precaution, Michelle has now received her first rabies vaccination and has been prescribed antiviral medication as doctors continue to monitor her symptoms. The location of the CDC quarantine facility where these monkeys were headed and the type of research that they were going to be used for has not been released, but this type of monkey is often used in medical studies. Thanks for watching. Click the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.